Hi, my name is Lawrence Thompson, and I'm the Central Conference YPD president. Um, and I'm here to report my self denial experience thus far throughout this week. For self denial 2012, I've been excited and ready. My officers have been excited. The whole Central Conference has been excited. And I'm just happy to report that myself, I've been denying myself of soda every day. And it's good. I feel healthier. You know, I've been drinking water instead. So trying to get on the healthy streak, you know. Um, and I have also been denying myself of tweeting between the hours of 8 p.m. and 11 p.m. And uh, that's been tough because I love to tweet, but um, that's what I've been denying myself of. And one thing that has really touched me throughout the South and Week and I've been thinking of and that's been on my tongue is praise, which is one of the connectional buzzwords. And um, I just wanted to share my testimony that I've had and the reasons I've had to praise God um, in a verse that I wanted to share with you all is Deuteronomy 10.21. He is your praise, and he is your God, who has done these great and awesome things for you, which your eyes have seen. And truthfully, my eyes have seen the great and wonderful things that God will be able to do. He is able to make a way out of no way. When I thought I couldn't pass a test, the Lord was able to give me a 90%. When I thought I wasn't going to be able to make it through the next day, I was tired, staying up till 3 o'clock in the morning doing homework. The Lord showed me um, and just strengthened my body and showed me that um, anything I, I have and anything I can do, I'm um, just through him. And I'm, I've truly been able to praise God for that. And one thing that's really just touched me today that really wanted me to do this video was I got my first college scholarship today for $1,000. Um, and it was just a blessing because I've been working hard and seeing a lot of applications on the internet, on paper, mail, and everything. I've just been getting rejection letter after rejection letter. And to get the scholarship today from a black fraternity was really, um, I just had to say thank you, God, for everything you're doing for me. Um, it's really going to help me pay for my schooling. I will be at Florida State University in the fall, and that's something that I can continue to praise God for because that was something that was heavy on my heart. I wasn't sure if I was going to go to University of Florida or Florida State, and God showed me that University of Florida, that Florida State University, the Knoll Seminoles, was where he wanted me to be. And um, I'm excited to make that transition in the fall. I'm excited for the things he continue to do in my life. I will continue to praise him. Um, even when I don't get what I want, and I was getting those rejection letters for scholarships, I knew that I had to praise God for the things he was continuing to do. And they always say, you know, thank him for waking you up in the morning. But he does so much more than that for us on a daily basis. Um, every time we eat, every time we take a breath, he is He is always there. He's always there with us. And you have to praise him for continuing to keep us in his arms and protect us. And that's what my testimony is. So I look forward to seeing you all at the next district event. Shout out to 11th Principal District. Shout out to the district president, Jamarian Moore, and shout out to the second vice president of the district, Destiny Glenban, for coming up with this idea and working so hard, and my second vice president, Rakia sanchez Patterson, for working so hard on the conference level. I truly do appreciate it. Shout out to my officers and my director, Ms. Tamika Fountain, and all the people on YPD. Thank you so much for allowing me this opportunity. That's something I can praise God for, is to be in this position and to minister to youth and to be a great leader. Um, in what God has called me to do. So thank you all very much. Enjoy and continue to deny yourself for this week and to learn more about yourself, just to thank God for everything he's done for you. Thanks, guys.